This is Tony Segro. Um, this is an area here of the Columbian Susquehanna HO Model Railroad that uh, was recently finished. It's the uh, the quarry area and already finished with scenery and such. And now I'm going to take you into an area that's not seen by the public, but uh, we run a number of cab view train videos, and this area is visible. Okay, on video. So what I want to try to do is, all it is right now is a bunch of wood. We want to do some scenery and such like that. And uh, well, let's go back there and take a look at what I'm talking about. Okay, this is part of the area that we call our hidden access. And there's probably enough room for, you know, uh, two people to work back here. But uh, when we do track videos, a lot of times the trains come through here, but all they see is all this wood. And as you can see, there's a bunch of wood all over the place. Goes all the way around. Goes up, way up to here, <laughs> over, back, around. This is our, this up here is our high line. Uh, we have our, uh, there's more mountain areas up here. Right here, if I go and look through here, that's the area that goes out to our uh, where the the uh, Mardic trestle is and such. Okay, and we just want to cover some of this up and do some painting. Already, I started doing tunnel linings. I figure the main lines because they're down here on this level down here. They're going to be below the uh, running level, the running line, and that's going to be below the high line. And uh, the inspiration I got for this is a lot of the Swiss. Alps trains like uh, if you ever look at cab view videos of St. Moritz and Chur and stuff like that you you see trains going along the cliffs and over viaducts and stuff like that and that's what I'm planning on looking at over here I did start painting some mountains painted some clouds on the wall first I started painting some mountains about where they'd be but eventually I'll go back and paint some uh, green on there to represent trees on the mountains Hey, down here there's four yard tracks that come out from behind the wall uh, and this these tracks go all the way down to the other end of the layout down near where the Opera House area is. <laughs> that was pretty long trackage. Um, and of course it comes out on a, uh, on a like a duck under kind of a bridge. You know you have to duck under to go underneath here and it's going to come out and it joins the main lines back here and of course here I had to rig up some kind of a tunnel because right through here is where the quarry area is and it comes out to the public view again. So I mean I need to do a little bit of engineering here. I did stick a, a tunnel portal in here. That's probably where we're going to have a tunnel portal there. Uh, I might have to do some kind of a retaining wall maybe to hide that backtrack. But we'll still have to be accessible to it. And then maybe this front, uh, the front line uh, will go into a tunnel again. And of course here we might have a little interlocking tower and such for the uh, for the four tracks coming out of the staging yard. So we'll keep you posted as more videos go up and, and uh, the progress on a make. Thank you.